Hey, the main thing you have to just look at this, man. I've learned over the last, I say about, I say about two months. Ignore them, and they end up going away. Um, the whole Paul Strange thing. Every now and then you'll see one of his so-called disciples pop up and do some dirt. But we need to just let these motherfuckers go. You have way more power than these motherfuckers can ever have. But you waste your power letting them know they can get to you. I do it too sometimes. Don't get me wrong because you know I bust a motherfucker off and yell and scream at him for two, three videos and just let it go. What normally shocks me is the out of the blue comments for no apparent reason at all. That's the only thing that ever gets me. It, when when I see it coming, well, okay, that video, okay, brings out those kind of people, no problem. But when it's like off the blue, like when the little handicapped guy called me a nigger and everybody's like saying, you know, I'm hating on handicaps. But I'll be honest with you, I don't give a hell or damn what you are. Now, if you a man and you walk up and you put your hands on somebody, you need to get whopped. If you're a girl and you walk up like a man and put your hands on somebody, you need to get whopped. If you're a handicapped and you're in a wheelchair and you roll up and, and put your hands on somebody, you need to get whopped. If you want to treat every individual like they're exactly the same, then it starts with no differences between anybody. If you can teach anybody right from wrong, how many handicapped people we see going to work when there are no jobs? They know right from wrong. So if somebody wants to just call you a nigger to be calling you a nigger or to fuck with you just to be fucking with you, then they deserve to get whopped. I don't give a fuck if it's the retarded policeman, a retarded doctor, retarded gynecologist, or whoever the fuck the motherfucker is. If you got the balls and the courage to say something negative and you got one video on your page, you gonna get fucking whopped. Or I'll be in no beef mode and say, fuck it. You can't even fade me, Kenny Thomas or Carney Thomas. Or some shit like that. Because people can't fade you, man. You shouldn't have to change your names. You shouldn't have to fight as hard as you do to prove any points to these people on YouTube. Fuck them. Come on through, man. And that's how that works. You do what you keep doing. And when these small, idiotic, nobody peons flag you the fuck off and ruin your name that you built, fuck them. Two can play that game. When you see a group of people flagging you, stop, shut what you're doing down, pull those videos, and lay in wait for their ass. Because nine times out of ten, somebody's laying in wait for you. And that's how they get you. You are a good young man. At first, when, when I first start watching your videos, on this motherfucker's radical as fuck. He scares the fuck out of me. Motherfucker, you tight. You stay tight. Don't let people change you. Fuck them. Keep this name. Dare them to take you down. But then make them have to take you down legally. Make them have to take you down right. You see people fall into the wayside constantly on YouTube. It's because they're being taken down shaky, falsely. Shutting them down falsely. They can't shut me down falsely. That's why I'm still here. That's why you still here. You know what I mean? You go back to who you were, future soldier. Fuck the rest of the people. You're the real future soldier. So fuck them. They can't change that. Don't let nobody ever change your course. And when you allow yourself to let this fodder slow you down, to let their, their um, grenades stop you from getting across the field, when you let them stop you, they win. When you let them change your name, you let them win. They cannot win. They cannot defeat you. That's why you're still here. The only thing that ever cost you is the title in which you wear. Fuck these people. Erase them from your thoughts. You see that little shit they put up? Fuck them. You see YouTube treat you funny and treat me funny? Fuck them. They cannot defeat you. You're too strong for them. So just do what you do and move on. Don't let this shit consume you. And I'm finna go get me a drink right now. Even though it's early in the morning, I'm finna go drink me one for you. I've been watching this video. It's like the second time I watched it. The third time. It's 1020. 
I'm gonna go drink one with my pancakes and eggs. You have a good one. See, it's getting dark outside and the light in here. I really don't pull a video. So I'm gonna go make my breakfast, man. Get the phone number from David J. And you call me on the phone, man. Tell Dave he's got to call me because I can't find that song. So I'm going to have to start whipping him out some new shit so we can get this product going. Um, get the number and call me. Put me on speakerphone. We'll blow up some videos like me, Father Judgment, and, <laughs> and Lynn Wolseley tried to do the other night. Bye. See you later, man. And listen, if there's any knowledge in this video... Pass it on. And I expect to see your new name pop up real soon. Because you're the real future soldier. Later. I'm not going to tube you no more, man. I know you've been up on it. Lady. Lately. Later.